Hello, good morning, friends. Now so it's my day four. I'm at the forward part of the ship, near the anchor station, and I will show you today what exactly is anchor, how it works on the ship. Now this is the forward part of the ship. This is how it look like. So these two things on the starboard and on the port is called windlass. which is used for handling of the anchor i will try to explain in as easy way as possible so this windlass is having a anchor chain which goes down to the chain locker and it has a lever to operate the motor once we switch on the power of this motor we have a button from that the system activates basically it operates on electro hydraulic system once we give the power to it through the electrical system the hydraulic oil gets pressurized and the pressure helps to ride this windlass normally to drop anchor we have two procedures walk back and uh, let go so regarding this i will talk in detail in my another video and i will be explaining the complete uh, anchoring procedure in that video so for now in a shorter way you just understand that this lever is used to operate this windlass and with the help of this we can uh, lower the cable and pick up the cable of the anchor and uh, after lowering generally in let go we have done let go in this port so generally in let go what we do is we lower this cable 1 meter above water level and after that we disengage the system uh, from the hydraulic power uh, by this disengagement arrangement this handle is given to disengage with this and after that uh, the anchor is already on uh, before that is already on brake and uh, once we reach to our position where we want to drop anchor we open this brake and the chain start going into the water so right now at this port we are riding on a port anchor so i will show you the view from here this is the chain going all the way down from there this is called a spurling pipe and coming out from this part outside this is called hose pipe and going into the water so now the chain is around 7 shekels inside the water one shekel is exactly 27.5 meter the forward part of the chain i will show you from the other side on the starboard side uh, uh, contains uh, the anchor what is exactly the anchor look like because this anchor is already in water of the port side so starboard side you can see and understand from there this uh, you see around the dirt particles this is all the rust from the chain during let go because it's uh, when uh, we let go the anchor it uh, this chain vibrate too much and release the uh, lot of uh, dirt uh, like a rust i show you from here this is how it looks like so this rust is basically uh, due to the deterioration of the chain so this is basically anchor on the starboard side how does it look like you can see from here this uh, part if you see is called a crown and this pointed part is called a flute basically this flutes go inside the once it uh, reaches the seabed these flutes embed inside the seabed and that is how this anchor holds the along with the help of chain holds the ship in its position you see these flutes also can turn 45 degree on the either side which helps the anchor to go inside the, the seabed and uh, hold on to it so basically the ship holds an anchor with a combined effect of uh, two things the chain and the anchor so friends that's all for today thanks for watching my video if you like my video please share with your friends and subscribe my channel and also click on that like button and in future i'll be bringing more interesting videos for you so be on my channel thank you this is third officer rahul reda signing off